Hello, welcome to the Repuzzle channel. Today I will be showing you step-by-step -step instructions for the Be Puzzled original 3D crystal puzzle, Tinkerbell. Now all these pieces are mostly numbered, so I will be telling you the number, displaying it down in the corner, and then showing you where and how it goes on the puzzle. Hopefully by the end of the video, we'll have gotten it together for you. All right, let's get started. Okay, first piece is gonna be this piece. This is piece number 10. And I'm just going to hold it like this so you guys can see it. You can set it down, it'll be a lot easier to build. Next piece, piece number 26. And with the piece facing downward, it's going to connect on the bottom left. Our next piece is piece number 21. And with the number facing downward, it's going to connect the top. Next piece is piece number 35. And with the number facing upward, it's going to connect on the bottom left. Next piece is 27. With the number facing upward, it's going to connect right into this little slot here. Next piece is piece number 16. And with the number facing downward, it's going to connect on the right. Next piece is piece number 24. Next piece is piece number 12. And with the number facing upward, it's going to connect at the top right. Next piece is piece number 31. And with the number facing upward, it's going to connect at the bottom right. Next piece is piece number 36. And with the number facing upward, it's going to connect on the right. Next piece is piece number 11. With the number facing upward, it's going to connect along the top. Next piece is piece number 19. With the number facing downward, it's going to connect on the bottom left. Piece number 34, with the number facing upward, it's going to connect on the right. Piece number 29, with the number facing upward, going to connect on the bottom left. Piece number four, with the number facing upward, it's going to connect on the right. Piece number 17, with the number facing downward, it's going to connect on the bottom left. Next piece, piece number 32. With the number facing upward, it's going to connect at the top left. 
The next piece is piece number nine with the number facing downward. It's going to connect on the bottom right. Next piece is piece number 22 with the number facing upward. It's going to connect at the top. Next piece is piece number five with the number facing downward. It's going to connect on the left. Next piece is piece number eight. And with the number facing upward, it's going to connect on the left. Next piece is piece number 18. And with the number facing upward, it's going to connect along the bottom. Next piece is piece number 30. With the number facing upward, it's going to connect at the bottom. Next piece is piece number three. With the number facing downward, it's going to connect at the top. Next, we're going to take will end up being her right arm. We're going to slide it under three. Just like that. And you're going to take what will end up being her left arm and just slide that into place just like the other side. Just like that. Okay, next pieces are going to be the wings. And they're just going to kind of hold together in the middle there. Then slide into the back. Your next piece is piece number 33 with the number facing downward. It's going to connect at the bottom. Next is piece number two. And with the number facing downward, it's going to connect along the front. I'm gonna set this down. rest back here so it's leaning so it doesn't tip over and what we're going to do is we're going to start on the head next we're going to start with the top part of the head so this is piece number seven and our next piece will be piece number 15 the number facing upward is going to connect along the right. And next piece is piece number one. And with the number facing downward, it's going to connect at the top. Next piece will be piece number 20 with the number facing downward. It's going to connect at the bottom. And then we're going to have piece number 25 
with the number facing downward. It's going to connect on the right. Next is piece number 13 with the number facing upward. It's going to connect on the bottom. Next piece is piece number 23 with the number facing upward. It's going to connect on the left. Next piece is piece number six. With the number facing upward, it's going to connect at the top. Next piece, we're going to take the face and we're just going to set it in place at the top. Next piece is piece number 28 with the number facing upward. It's going to connect along the bottom. And piece number 14 with the number facing downward. It's going to connect at the top. Just like that. I'm going to slide the pole through the head and line up the part sticking out right here with the little part just indented right there. And there is a part sticking out right at the front of her face here. You're going to line that up with the part on her neck with the notch out of it. Slide it all into place. And then you're going to take her hair and just slide it into place. And she comes with a stand, so you can put her on the stand. And that's it. So this is how it should look when it's finished. If you have any suggestions of what I should put together next time, let me know in the comment section. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.